beautiful as I promised myself I would and the dogs enjoying the afternoon here in the crossroads right doggies right it's been such a busy day busy week Oop. we need this time hey, Jimmy there's a uh, more than just you that needs to do this walk come on huh? rocket ship to the moon I've been here earlier today nice little space for the dongies to just kind of chillax a little we're all needing a little chillaxation right dongies right dong oops caught you in a private moment there Stella sorry hey, Jimmy give her a privacy good lord ah Jimmy doesn't care does he all right peel out peel out peel out why some dogs do that what a beautiful fall evening this is how you know Stella is chillaxed that's how quiet it is amazing I'm varying my normal route just slightly to get on get in a little bit of rails end hopefully here we are at the parking garage there's the Pencoy bridge there's the backside of Union Station you can see uh, Liberty Memorial over there and the antique train cars are always here and that way is looking west into the sunset oh <laughs> and here I am enjoying my moment of Zen you know even if no train comes just being up here and chillaxing is uh, worth it but there's a train coming from the west. There you go. Rails in. Come on, donkeys, let's go. Don't forget, as you're walking. To observe the history around you like here's old boss Pendergast Democratic Club headquarters are here up on the second floor next to the Hotel Monroe love this neon
is another great sign. This one is actually pretty old and has been remodeled and updated. And you gotta sweep the Kansas City skyline. That concrete structure, tall building in the middle, it's a power and light building made with Boss Tom Pendergast ready mix concrete. And so is City Hall and the Jackson County Courthouse over there. Well, City Hall being hidden by two light. Or Jackson County Courthouse being hidden by two light. There it is. Come around the back end of the two light. It's another beautiful building, marquee and sign, which has been restored. And it's finally open. Beer Fluenza has shuttered this place for a little while. Now it's got new ownership and that's beautiful marquee. And speaking of marquees, I walk this way just so I could see this. And I love the facade that Jimmy sees a dog he's interested in. So if it's jerky, it's because he's pulling. Jimmy, come on. And the hotel president. And speaking of landmark old signs, there's one there. The old Bach was a classic old Kansas City hotel. I believe it was uh, in its days of some mule Bach in the 80s. That's at least when they had an auction. And uh, it's now owned by a, a chain. At least the sign is still there. Um, I think they still call it the mule Bach, but I don't know. I guess I have to look it up. I have killed the battery on my gimbal, so I gotta go to my mobile device now. In the shadow of all this tourism, let us not forget history, lest we be doomed to repeat it. And if you'd like to purchase some mid-century modern and googie in Kansas City, there it is. I guess people would like me to comment. I can't get it. What's over my shoulder over there, but... Yeah. I won't say anything. We're all guilty. Well, that's our walk. We're back to where we started. Right, Dongs? Good walk? Good walkie? Huh? Alright, it's not over with yet. I'm going to pick up Wangs at the Peanut downtown. I gotta talk over this scanner because um, I gotta use the scanner when I'm in this car and be ready to go at a moment's notice to if something explodes. But <coughs> uh, I like to get over this cold. But we really needed this walk, didn't we, Dongs? We needed it big time. And, uh, whoops. Streets are really narrow here when people are parked on both sides. These, these side streets, these sort of forgotten back roads and uh, the crossroads area. Everything's covered with, uh, with art down here. It's beautiful. But anyway, on to our mission. Wangs. Here we are. The peanut. I don't know, a kid cut himself carving a pumpkin. That sucks. We got our wangs.